Nate, I need to speak with you. And Chuck. We don't have anything to say to you. You need to go now. It's okay. I may be angry, but I need to know the truth. I met your father when he was still with Elizabeth. I was very young. I couldn't resist him. He was charming, handsome. It felt as if he had the whole world at his feet. I knew he was involved with someone else. You mean Mary? Yeah. He had an affair. And it only ended when I got pregnant. But you kept the baby. You must have wanted me. I mean, why did you give me up? I was a mess. Mixed up in the wrong things with the wrong people. Unfit to raise a child. And then Elizabeth, she couldn't get pregnant. It seemed like a way to solve all our problems. So you made a deal? After it was over, I left town. Alone. And ashamed. But a few years later, when I heard that Elizabeth had died, although I now know that wasn't the case, I came back. But Elizabeth couldn't do it. She couldn't stick to her end of the bargain. Raise someone else's child as her own. I wanted to see you, desperately. But Bart thought it'd be too confusing for you. So you just stayed away until eight months ago? When I came back to the city last fall, I was hoping to watch over you. From afar. Nate's bed is not that far. I, I didn't intend for things to get as serious as they did with Nate. And then I thought, if you never find out the truth, What's the harm? So what does it all mean? Now that I know. That's for you to decide. You know where to find me. But remember, the most important rule in gambling is that the house always wins.